Yo, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to the Kansas Jayhawks Dynasty. Here today your Kansas Jayhawks are on the road after getting beaten down by Nebraska and Memphis down the road at Kibbe Dome here against the Idaho Vandals. This will be a game that Kansas should look to win. They played a couple of tough opponents in the Memphis Tigers and the Nebraska Cornhuskers, especially Nebraska, but this is an opponent who's also 2-0, as is Kansas, and an opponent that we should be beating pretty handily. We're getting this one, third and four, Ryan Will starting his day, floating this one right side, and he is intercepted by Dags. His first pass of the day is picked off and returned to the 10-yard line of the Kansas Jayhawks. Not how you want to start a day at all. Ryan Wilson getting the third star of the year. We're not quite sure what we want to do at QB yet, and he is not making a very good case for himself after leading us to 0-2 so far in this season. Now playing Idaho, he needs to have a win here. Saunders breaks a tackle, and Isaiah Saunders puts Idaho on the board. Just a minute into the game, we had the ball first, turn it over, and they get a touchdown. It's 7 0 Idaho, and Ryan Willis has got to make something happen here on this drive. Steven Sims Jr. is going to catch that one for a 15 yard gain. A good completion by Ryan Willis. Now, first and 10, he's going to throw over the middle. There's Tyler Patrick. Patrick's going to have a nice gain to Idaho territory, a gain of 20. Second and 10, now Ryan Willis is going to keep this one on the option. He's running up the gut. He finds a nice hole, and he picks up 10 in the first down. First and 10, going to run the read option, give this one to Martin. Martin's going to have a nice little run there, 7. It's going to be third and 2. Ryan Willis is going to keep this one. He's going to run through him, and he's going to pick up the first down and slide into the red zone. Second and 7, now going to run the option once again. This time he's going to pitch it to Shadler. Shadler's going to be knocked down after a gain of 1. So I'm up third and 6. Willis dropping back, throwing, had a man wide open, and he throws it way behind him, and it's intercepted the second time on two drives. Elijah Williams this time. You'll see the replay, not only from the game, but also from me. Willis had a good drive up to that point. Look at that wide open Tyler Patrick. So much room ahead of him. An easy touchdown if it's anywhere in his vicinity. Instead, it's 10 yards behind him and intercepted by Idaho. They have the 7-0 lead here. Saunders with a 9-yard rush. Now 2nd and 1. Amos going to give this one to Sa Saunders. Saunders on the right side. Stiff arming. Breaking a tackle. Stiff arming once again. Breaks it again. He trips up. Alex Manning takes him down but after a gain of 12. Amos giving it to Saunders once again. Up the middle. He's breaking a tackle. He's spinning off another. And he's going to pick up 10 yards there. Second and inches now. Amos going to keep this one. He's going to run. He's wearing two gloves. He's Teddy two gloves except for it's Amos. Gunner, gunner two gloves. I don't know. Call him what you want. First and ten. Saunders on the right side is going to get the handoff. He's going to stiff arm Alex Manning, but Alex Manning will bring him down, but after a gain of six. Second and four. Amos drop him back. He's looking. He's going to throw right. He's going to find his receiver, Boston. Boston with a nice reception. Gain of 15. First and ten. Amos Drop him back. Throw him left. He finds a man. That one is Garner. Garner inside the five. A 30-yard reception for Michael Garner. Now second and goal. Amos keeping it. Amos waltzes his way into the end zone. Three-yard touchdown run. And Idaho really punches Kansas in the mouth. They're up 14-0 after two drives. Two interceptions by Willis and two touchdown drives by Idaho. Need to make something happen, and that is not going to happen. And that's not going to work. Third and 10, Ryan Willis need a big first down. He's throwing right. He finds Charlotte with a beautiful comeback route and a good completion gain of 20. Now in midfield, first and 10, Willis. Dump this one down to Charlotte. Charlotte's going to catch that one. He's blown up, but he picks up 10. Second and inches. Hand this one off to Shadler. Shadler up the middle. He's going to pick up the first down and a little bit more. Gain of about five, six yards. First and 10. Willis keeping this one on the read option. He's going to break a tackle. He's going to go up the middle. He's going to fight his way forward for a gain of six. He's going to take us into the second quarter. Second and four for Willis. He's throwing this one left. He finds Charlotte with the one-handed catch. Dalen, Charlie, you don't see that much in NCAA football, but he catches that one there for 16 yards. Look at that one. One-handed with his left hand. First down. Now first and 10, Ryan Willis going to throw this one to Harrell. Harrell's going to catch that one. He's going to be down about the five-yard line, gain of eight. Second and two now. Ryan Willis going to keep this one on the read option. He's into the end zone in a very, very nice drive from Ryan Willis in the offense. Cuts the lead right in half. They answered very quickly, 14-7. to Now it's up to the defense to get a stop. First and 10, Boston motion. Hand this one off to Saunders. Saunders takes this one around the left side. He's going to be breaking a tackle, but he's going to pick up eight as Alex Manning brings him down. Now second and two, Amos going to keep this one up the middle. He's going to break a tackle. He's up the middle, breaks another, and he's finally taken down, but a nice gain. Third and 10, can they get off the field? Amos dropping back, throwing left. He just dumps this one down to Ungerer. Ungerer is going nowhere. Pick up a four, and this will set up a fourth and seven punting. They're faking once again. 
This time we're ready for it, unlike the Memphis game, but this time we are, and we stop him with great field position, a chance to tie this game up. Nine-yard rush by Willis. Third and two, now trying to convert. Willis keeps it. Pitches this one on triple option. Tyler Patrick with a lot of room on the right side. He's going to pick up 10 inside the 30. First and 10, Ryan Willis dropping back. He's going to dump this one down to Chase Harrell. Spin move, breaks the tackle. He's going to fight his way forward for a gain of 9 to the 20. Third and 1, got to get the first down. Willis is going to keep this one. Willis has a lot of room, breaks another tackle. He's inside the 10. He's going to flip this one to Shadler. Shadler inside the 5 to the 4. Great play by Ryan Willis. First and goal. Going to give this one to Ryan Shadler. Ryan Shadler up the middle. Touchdown, Kansas Jayhawks. Two fantastic drives by Ryan Willis. Ties it up at 14 with two and a half or so to go. It's Idaho's ball now. First and 10 for Amos. Amos going to get out of the pocket, and he's going to break a tackle of Armstrong Jr. Pick up the first down before being brought down after a gain of 13. First and 10 now. Amos going to keep this one on the read option. Once again, he's on the left side. He's going to be taken down, but not before he picks up six. Second and four. Sanders in motion. Amos dropping back. He's looking. He's going to scramble once again. He's a very dual threat QB, and he's going to pick up seven on the right side. Now third and 15. Chance to get off the field. Amos. He's going to step up in the pocket. Just drop this one down to Saunders. Saunders is taken down after a gain of seven, and it's fourth and eight with a minute and a half to go. So punting, once again, we've been faked on twice. Make it three times. Cook, the punter's going to throw. He's going to find Shelby. Shelby catches that one down at the 30, pickup of 17 yards, and the first down. Are you kidding me? We're ready for it, too. I knew it was coming. I had the punt return safe, man. And our cornerback, Jack Motley, gets beat off the line of scrimmage, and it's Idaho ball. They have a chance to score and take the lead right before half as Saunders picks up seven. Now second and three. Amos dropping back. He's looking. Throws over the middle. He finds Garner. Garner down at about the 11-yard line pickup of 12. First and 10, 40 seconds to go. Amos throwing it right. That one is intercepted. Ian Peterson picks that one off in the end zone. Wow, what a play. We needed that one, too, by Ian Peterson. The offense has the ball with 36 seconds to go. Nice play by Ian Peterson. Now, first and 10, Willis trying to make something happen. Dumps this one down to Charlotte. Charlotte picks up a couple of blocks right down the seam. Charlotte at the 30, the 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown. Kansas Jayhawks, Dalen Charlotte. The interception by Ian Peterson, and the next play back is Ryan Willis to Dalen Charlotte on the screenplay for 80 yards. Beautiful blocking all the way downfield. The offensive line picks up the first row, and then the second there is picked up by the receivers. Gone to the house, and that'll take us into the half. Kansas 21, Idaho 14. That's a good half of football. Can we, can we replicate it, though, here in the second half? First and 10, Amos is going to roll out. He's going to be hit and sacked. There is Armstrong Jr. on the sack. That's a good start. Second and 23, Amos throwing this one left. He's going to find Anderson. Anderson's going to have a nice pickup there of about 13. Gets it all back. Third and 11, Amos. Amos, whatever. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm going to go with Amos. Saunders on the screen plays. Taking down, no gain. Fourth down, Ryan Willis will get the ball back. Chance to make it a two-possession lead. First and 10, triple option. Willis going to keep this one. He's going to pitch this one back, but Charlotte didn't really run that quite right. That could have been broken loose. Third and five, though. Ryan Willis dropping back. He's going to float this one left side to the sideline. That one is almost caught, but broken up, and we'll have to punt it to Idaho. Need a defense to make a play. It's first and 10. They're inside their own 10-yard line. That's a zero-yard gain on the reception. Now, second and 10. Amos, right side. He's going to miss his tight end. Third and 10. Chance to get a really good field position. Amos dropping back. Here comes the pressure. He floats this one. It's knocked down. Could have been picked off by Ty Tyrone Miller Jr., but instead he knocked it down played it safe. Second and seven, get this one to Taylor Martin for a three-yard gain. Now third and four, Sims Jr. in motion. Ryan Willis dropping back, throwing this one right side. He finds Tyler Patrick inside the 15, gain of 17 yards. First and 10, Ryan Willis up the middle. He's going to pitch this one to Shadler. Somehow got it to him. Shadler in the end zone. 12-yard touchdown run, Ryan Shadler. Under three to go in the third quarter. Looking for a first win on the year. 28 unanswered against Idaho. First and 10. Now Saunders catches one on the left side on the, around the out of bounds. He picks up seven. Now third and three. Amos just gets rid of it. Three and out. It's going right back to the Jayhawks offense who is on fire all of a sudden. First and 10. Pitches one to Shadler on the right side. He has a lot of room. He's past midfield. He's inside the 45. That's a big gain of 22 yards. 
First and 10, runs triple option. Once again, it's worked well all day. Ryan Willis up the middle, slides. Nice gain of 13 yards. Third and nine now. Ryan Willis, he's going to scramble out on the left side. He's going to throw on the run, improving that accuracy game by game. First down, Dalen Charlotte, 12-yard reception. Now first and 10. Here's Ryan Willis keeping this one. He's going to pitch this one back to Taylor Martin, who runs through a man, and he picks up 10 yards. Third and inches now. Can he pick up the first down? We give it to Shadler. Shadler up the middle. Picks up the first down inside the five. Gain at three. First and goal. Ryan Willis to start the fourth quarter. Dropping back. Throwing left. Finds Steven Sims Jr. 35 unanswered. Four-yard touchdown reception. Steven Sims Jr. Ryan Willis, his second touchdown of the day after those two interceptions in the first two drives. He's responded with 35 points on the offensive side. In the fourth quarter now, Idaho needs a big drive here, and that's a good start right there. Isaiah Saunders up the middle for a nice gain. Now Amos on second and 10. He's dropping back. He's throwing left. He finds Luckett. Luckett with a nice reception, breaks the tackle, and he picks up 11 for, 11 for Brandon Luckett. Third and seven now, Amos dropping back. He's looking, throws to Saunders. Saunders picks up the first down. He's a very solid halfback, 11-yard reception. First and 10 for Amos now. He's going to scramble with this one up the middle. He's got a little bit of room. He's going to run through a defender, and he's going to pick up 10 yards in the first down. Second and nine now. Hand, the, hand this one off to Saunders. Saunders out the middle. Breaks the tackle into the end zone. And they finally stop the bleeding. But not before we get 35 unanswered. And it's a 14-point lead. you got to think a score here probably ends the game. But Ryan Willis needs to make that one happen. First and 10 run the read option. He pulls it out. Scores eight. Or <laughs> gets eight. Now third and three. Ryan Willis going to keep this one. Once again, he's just going to pick up the first down and slide under four to go. Second and seven. Ryan Willis keeping it once again on the read option. Sliding again. Gain of eight. Second and six. This time he's going to Shadler. Shadler on the left side. He's got a lot of room. He's going to run through a defender. And he's going to pick up nine in the first down. Second and seven. Send to Charlotte in motion. Hand this one off to Dalen Charlotte. He bounces off his own lineman. He's on the outside. Inside of ten. Inside of five. Touchdown. Dalen Charlotte brought in a nice little formation with just Charlotte on the outside. And a lot of blockers ahead of Ryan Willis. Kind of like a wildcat, but with Ryan Willis at QB. Handed off to Charlotte. He goes in the end zone. 25 yards and a touchdown. And that will win the game, basically. Idaho's going to have one last possession and try to get some points. Saunders on the left side. Had in his stats, 11-yard reception. Second and five, Amos dropping back, throwing right. He's going to find Ungerer for the first down. A nice completion, a minute 20 to go. Amos dropping back, throws over the middle. Intercepted Hudson Hall, and that is a great way to cap off this great game. We should be beating Idaho, but it's good to get some momentum. And look at this, the victory formation. First time we've seen it all year. And I've been wanting to get it. A tough first two games, and we get a nice victory against Idaho. 42 to 21, 35 unanswered in that game after we go down 14 to nothing. And Ryan Willis leads the offense to some great drives. 12 for 22, 213 yards, 15 carries, 100 yards, two passing touchdowns, and one rushing rushing touchdown. A great game for Ryan Willis. And I hope you guys are enjoying this win. I'm finally Finally in the win column, I, I love to be here. I thought we'd have a good start to this year. I thought we had a very solid team, but getting blown out in our first two games was not at all what I wanted, but Ryan Willis finally comes through with a nice victory against a team we should be beating, and we do get the victory. If you did enjoy today's episode, make sure you hit the like button and comment what your predictions are against TCU, the number 22 ranked team in the nation next week away from home at TCU. Let me know your predictions for that game in the comment section. Thank you guys for watching. As always, I'm out. Peace.